The hierarchical organization of living systems from the highest level to the lowest follows a structured order, with each level building upon the previous one. Here's how it's typically organized. Biosphere. The entire planet and all its ecosystems where life exists, including land, water, and the atmosphere. Ecosystem. A community of living organisms interacting with each other in their non-living environment, such as a forest or an ocean. Community. All the different populations of species that live and interact in a particular area. Population. A group of individuals of the same species living in a specific area. Organism. A single individual living entity like a human tree or bacterium. Organ system. A group of organs working together to perform a particular function such as the digestive system. Organ a structure composed of tissues working together to perform specific functions like the heart or lungs. Tissue. A group of similar cells that work together to perform a particular function such as muscle tissue. Cell. The basic unit of life, the smallest structure capable of performing all life processes. Organelles specialize structures within a cell that perform specific functions, like the nucleus and mitochondria. Molecule, a group of atoms bonded together, representing the smallest unit of a chemical compound that can take part in a chemical reaction such as DNA and proteins. Atom, the smallest unit of an element forming the basic building block of matter. Subatomic particles, particles that make up atoms, including protons, neutrons and electrons. Elementary particles, the most basic building blocks of matter, which include particles such as quarks and leptons. For example, electrons are a type of lepton, while protons and neutrons are made of quarks. This hierarchy helps us understand how complex biological structures are organized, from the global scale of ecosystems down to the fundamental units of life. Nature is ultimate.